guys, so different setup today. I was, my room is such a mess right now, and I was way too lazy to clean it and my, make my bed for my background, so we're just over here where you can't see any of the mess. But today I'm going to be doing the Colors of the Rainbow tag, and I really liked this video when I first saw it um, on Ingrid's channel, Miss Glamorazzi. I will put the username of the girl who created it right here, and um, I was tagged by a decent amount of girls, so I'm going to um, list all of their channels in the description box. So thank you so much if you tagged me, and at least I think I was tagged by like at least like three people. Maybe maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. But I will link them all and probably like list them right here. So thank you for tagging me. I'm going to go ahead and tag all of you guys that are watching this. Probably not specific people since so many people have already done this video. But if you want to do it, you can do it and say that I tagged you because I did. So um, basically what this tag is is just you go through the colors of the rainbow, Roy G. Biv, and then um, also pink and multicolored, my knuckle just cracked, are included in those. And you just go through and you talk about either like a fashion or a beauty product that you like that's that color. So it's pretty simple. And I'm excited because I, I don't think I've done like a tag video like this in a while. And I love doing tag videos. So I'm excited. I hope you guys are. So let's go ahead and get started with the first color, red. So for red, I chose one of the new Revlon lip butters. I I don't even know how many of these I have. I think it's up to like 12. It's really a problem. They're so amazing. Um, if you haven't tried a Revlon Lip Butter, you're crazy. They have four new shades, I think, for like the springtime. Um, and this one's Wild Watermelon. And it's just like a bright, corally red. And it's just it's perfect for like a bold lip for the summer. So I love this. And... That's my red item. For orange, I chose a fashion item. I was going to choose a cream blush, but then I was like, I mean, I like that cream blush, but I don't wear it that much. So I was like, uh, I really like this for my orange item. I've worn this in videos before. It's my neon orange circle skirt. It's from Topshop. I love this. I got it when I was in New York, and I just think it's such a fun color. You guys know my obsession with circle skirts, or skater skirts, whatever you want to call them. I call them circle skirts because... I'm not a skater. So yeah, this one, I just had to choose this for orange. Um, if you guys are interested in this, I'll link it on the Topshop website down below. I'll link everything that I'm talking about. As I said, I've started doing that when I talk about products in my videos, just so you guys can easily have access to them. All right, next product is yellow, and I chose my Benefit Lemonade. And if you open it up, I wonder if, yeah, okay, it's gonna show up yellow on camera, because I brought, it wasn't showing up that yellow when I looked at it, so I brought this concealer, so I could, this is my boing to compare them so you could see like the color difference. This one has a lot more yellow because it corrects like blue and purple undertones um, like on your eyelids and under your eyes and stuff and I just love using this. It really does help um, color correct your eyes and it acts as like a nice primer. You can put it on your lids. I even put it under my eyes which I don't know if you're supposed to do that but this is like one of my only yellow-ish makeup items, but I really, really do love this. For green, I had a hard time narrowing it down. I also, I had like a decent amount of green stuff, um, but I chose my Simple Makeup Remover Wipes because I just can't get over how much I love these, how gentle they are, and don't leave my face red or any way irritated. I am obsessed with these. So they're just the Simple Sensitive Skin Experts Cleansing Facial Wipes. And I've also been using the toner and really liking that as well, but I couldn't pick two items. So I just picked these because they're amazing. So I think I'm going to definitely continue to buy these for a very long time. And I mean, obviously the actual wipes aren't green, but the packaging is green. So love these. For blue, I chose one of my favorite mascaras, and that is the Maybelline, I forgot what brand it was for a second, the Maybelline Rocket Volume Express Mascara. I've been using this for months now and absolutely loving it. I have this one and I have the waterproof version. I like, I think this one works better, but I use the waterproof one when I want to wear waterproof mascara. And it's a really, really good volumizing, amazing mascara from the drugstore. This is what it looks like if you haven't seen it, which you probably have, but if you haven't, it's pretty affordable. I think it's like six, seven, eight something like that and I love it it gives you amazing volume this and the great lash lots of lashes are my two favorite right now um, well they've been for a while mascaras from the drugstore for indigo I think this is in the indigo family um, it's this nail polish when I think indigo I think bluish purple so I hope that's right because if you like compare I don't know if you compare this to this like this has some purple in it as you can tell so this is a nail polish that I absolutely love that I really don't hear people 
talking about. I got it like at the end of last summer and it's Boxer Shorts by Essie and it's just this beautiful purpley blue when it's on your nails you can't tell like in different lighting it looks purple and in other lighting it looks blue and it just looks really cool and it's an amazing nail polish so I need to paint my nails this sometime very soon because I love it and I think baby hair. I think it's a really pretty color for the summertime. For Violet, I don't know, why isn't purple in the rainbow? Roy G. Bibb, that's, <laughs> I don't even say that's the rainbow. I'm getting off topic here, but I just say like red, orange, yellow, green, pink, blue, purple. But I don't think that's right. But that's the rainbow to me. But Roy G. Bibb is apparently how everyone else says it. So, Violet. I chose none other than my Urban Decay Primer Potion. This is just a little baby bottle of it, but I've been using this for years now, probably like three years, maybe even more than three years, probably more than three years, and it's just amazing. Never fails me, best eyeshadow primer. That's the end of Roy G. Biv, and then we have pink and multicolored. So for pink, I had to choose my Beauty Blender. What else would I choose? This is, look how hot pink it is, and of course it has foundation on the bottom because I use it every single day. But you guys, I literally cannot tell you enough, if you don't have a beauty blender and you wear liquid foundation, you really, really should consider getting one. It, I mean, it's kind of expensive if you like think about this. Okay, I think this is $20. It's so worth it. It's so much better than any brush. It literally, because you use so much less product, you use so much less foundation with this because it doesn't like soak it all up like a brush does. So... I recommend the Beauty Blender so, so, so much. Um, you can get it from like Sephora online. You can get it other places online, but I'll probably link to it down below on Sephora um, or just like the cheapest place you can get it. And I just, I can't recommend it enough. You can use the little point to go around like your nose and under your eyes. I just, it is my baby. Like I don't use anything else for foundation. And I have like a million of these. Like I have two other ones sitting there. I really like when they're like brand new and hot pink, but you know, it gets a little dirty and you can't really, you can't really get it out that well. Okay, so I went on a little rampage about that one, but love it so much. And last item is multicolored, and I was like, what do I want to choose for this? I was looking at, like, my makeup products, and I was like, I have a pair of shoes that I love that's perfect for this. These Toms. These Toms. I got these, like, last spring. I really don't know if they still make them. Um, I hope they do or something similar to it if they do still make them I'll link them down below, but they are just awesome multicolor toms that go with so much stuff I love to like color block where like two different colors like one co Solid color on top one solid color on bottom and then wear these to like kind of like tie it together I don't know they have like every color of the rainbow on them So they're really good for the colors of the rainbow tag and I just freaking love these shoes I think they're awesome for spring and summer you know some people don't like Tom's I love Tom's they're so comfy if I'm going to somewhere like a theme park or if I'm gonna be walking all day I won't usually wear tennis shoes I'll wear Tom's because I don't know I think they're cuter and they pretty much give you the same amount of comfort so that is my pick for multicolor and this video is under 10 minutes long this is so shocking for me Oh my gosh, I hope I did everything. So that is the Colors of the Rainbow tag. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This was really fun to do. And thank you to the girls who tagged me. Again, I tag all of you guys. You can leave it as a video response if you do it. And I think that's everything. So again, if you're interested in any of these products, I'll put a list of everything and links down below in the description box. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day or night. Please like this video down below if you liked it. It would mean a lot to me and it really helps me out. And I'll see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye. And let's go get... Nope.